Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today we're out for a bit of a morning explore while the wind is good. We're out here on, this is Lake Huron. So uh, we're just north of Sabo Beach, which is down that way. And what we're gonna be looking at today is what's known as the Fishing Islands, which is a very famous chain of islands back in like the 1800s. It was very contested for who got to use these grounds for fishing because it's some of the best fishing for whitefish and stuff like that up here on Lake Huron. So uh, I figured let's come out and have a quick look at it. So uh, let's explore the fishing islands up here on uh, Lake Huron. Let's go. Fishing islands exist because it's very shallow uh, on this uh, side of Lake Huron, so on the east side of Lake Huron. Uh, so you get all the rocks that have been piled up over storms, and then the islands kind of form out of that. So it's not like they're like cliffs or anything massive, or anything. it's just all these little interconnected islands. And with that, all the fish come in here and kind of have a nice protected area. So that's why they've been quite popular for fishing. So. Anyways, we're just gonna keep going through it. I mean, it's not a ton to really look at, but it's a beautiful day on the water, so let's see what we can find. Let's keep going. Landed. I apologize for all the seagull noise. What are the odds I get pooped on for this? <laughs> oh, gee. Probably a mess right there. <laughs> That's a broom. All right, I'll leave your island. I don't think I can get over there, anyways. Okie doke. Not much to this. It's cool you can just get off, check out these little things. This one does not stink like all those other bird islands, so, so I took the risk. Oh look, would have been a nest right in there. That's a well protected. Why I'm not worried to come on the island because uh, I know there's nests on these islands, but all the little ones have already hatched and grown up or that far along going into the season. So uh, you're not stressing them out for anything like that. So anyways, let's head back out and keep going. Stop here for a quick second and take a look around. Now, how convenient is this? You just without slipping. 
can just bring your CD right in. Let me see if I can get it a little bit closer. Yeah, look at that. Check this out, guys. A little bathtub. Yo, come sit here on a sunset, eh? So the sun would set out over that, over like here on there. That is pretty awesome, I gotta admit. Hey, just pull your sea dew in, have a quick little lunch, something like that. It's not bad at all. Now, granted, only on calm days. If you had a west wind right now, I bet you it is pumping over here. I mean, probably be cool to see, but you know. I wouldn't bring my CD this close. <laughs> All right, guys, let's keep exploring. Whoa, whoa, the bugs are bad. Trees growing out of the rocks here. Amazing. All right, time to head back to the studio. Oops, someone had a little lunch there. All right, let's head on and see what else we can find.
right guys well that pretty much does it for this trip out here to see the fishing islands i uh, hope you enjoyed it uh pretty cool to see like i said uh, a lot of history out here and stuff so anyways that's pretty much it we're gonna wrap it up and head back the wind kind of picked up from a direction that it was not supposed to pick up from so kind of cutting this one a tad bit short but next time we're gonna probably or in another video somewhere we're gonna come from launch from the same area we're going to go south towards Savo Beach and see what we can see going down that way. So thanks again so much for coming along on this adventure. And just thank you so much for everyone that's been liking, subscribing, hitting that subscribe button, making all the comments. I love hearing from you guys. It's great to hear from you. So thank you so much for that. And really, guys, just uh, the summer's getting going here. We're going to start making some more adventures. And uh, let's just uh, see what we can do. So uh, thank you again for coming along. Hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you on the next adventures. So until then, be safe out on the water. Peace.